Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Welcome back. Uh, today I have a little, little tiny haul to show you guys. This is um, from the Bath and Body Works that is near my work. I brought my three aromatherapy lavender vanilla candles back. Um, they were in, I discussed that in my empties video. Uh, I've only burned one of them. It smelled like kerosene. I tried it three times. It still smelled like kerosene. I wasn't going to keep it. I wasn't going to do it. I'm not doing it. I can go on a rant. People don't like it when I return stuff. And I don't know why. I don't know why they care. Sorry, I have to drink some water. I have a really sore throat for some reason. I don't know why people care that I, if I get a product that sucks and I want to exchange it. It's like any other thing in life. But for whatever reason, people get bothered by it. But I did exchange those. I brought them back. No receipt. They still sell them in the store, so who cares? Um, it's not like it's an old product and I was exchanging it for a new, exp more expensive one. Um, I did exchange them for ones that were like under the current sale or whatever. So um, I picked them out, not for me, but they're pretty much going to be gifts. And so I'll just show you what I got. I got ones that I thought smelled nice that people would like, and I'm hoping that they will perform well. The first one that I got, I actually really like this jar. It's, um, if you can see... It's kind of pearlescent and it's not see-through, but this is fresh cut lilacs. This is one of my younger sister's favorite scents. Her birthday is at the end of June and I got it for her. My darling sister, another candle, this is the three wick obviously, and it's just simple. I thought it would be pretty. I thought it would be something that she could reuse maybe if she wants to tear off this yeah, she could tear this off. Tear off this label when she's done. Because, like, the jar itself, it's not like a sticker. I don't think. No, it's not a sticker. So, it's a pretty jar. She doesn't want it. I'll take it when she's done with it. There's that one. Fresh Cut Lilacs. And then I picked up an Endless Weekend. I've had this. Have I had this? I've had this in, I think, maybe a wallflower or body care or something in the past. And, um... My friend Kim, she has a YouTube channel. It's Canada Kim 1978. If you don't know Kim by now, now you know. Go subscribe. Uh, I would say most of my subscribers already know Kim, but yeah, she's one of my one of my good friends, one of my favorite people on YouTube, and um, she really likes this scent. So uh, I decided I wanted to try it. It's not showing how pretty this jar is on camera. It's a lot more turquoise, darker, watery very very pretty glass and oh, I want to keep this I was thinking about giving this to my mom <laughs> because I think this is a scent that she would like but I think I have to keep this because Kim really likes it and I feel like I need to keep it and try it so I also want to give you guys candles that I've been burning and I just the ones that I have left that I want to keep that I don't want to sell if you watched my candle collection video recently there are ones that I want to keep and burn through keep and hoard and then ones that I want to sell and the ones that I want to keep and burn are all like fall scents or like cologne scents and I'm just not into that right now so I'm, I want to burn stuff for you guys I just don't have anything that's like seasonally appropriate right now so maybe I'll burn this one or I'll give that one to my mom and I'll keep this one and burn this one this is lavender coconut I know everybody went crazy for it when it first came out and people loved it or they hated it and I just kind of sat back and wanted to see what the reviews were for it because I just, I don't need to be the first person to try something. I really don't want to be that person that buys something and then exchanges it just because I wanted to be the first person to try something. I'm just, I'm over that. So I want something that I know is going to do well. And I think this one did, for the most part, have pretty good reviews. It does have the wicks that have the black center. And although I love lavender and coconut and vendor wax, it's just okay to me like in candle form. But some people seem to really like it, so I wanted to give it a shot. I thought, hey, why not? If I change my mind, I'll give it to my mom and she'll like it. All of these were candles that I bought with the um, intention of being able to gift them or keep them. What do you guys think? Should I keep them? Well, I know I'm lilacs is going to my sister. I already know that for sure because I don't like the lilac scent. 
I don't know if I should keep lavender, coconut, and endless weekend. I probably will um, keep both of them and burn them, but we'll see. If you guys have burned any of these and you have your opinions on these specific candles and how your performance went with them, if they're crappy, let me know. Please let me know. I don't want to, I would rather exchange it brand new if you had a bad experience with it. So, um, that's it. That's all I got. <laughs> Nothing exciting for Bath and Body Works. I didn't really even walk around and look at body care or anything. I'll probably shop the semi-annual sale. There are things that I want. I'm running out of soap, so I'll buy, I'll buy some soap. So for those of you that watch my channel and really like the Bath and Body Works stuff, I will be doing some semi-annual sale shopping. I want to get a couple wallflower bulbs when they're on sale for the semi-annual sale, which is coming up in June. And then soaps, like I said. Probably some a couple candles if they are cheap. If they're going to put them at $12, I'm not going to get them. And obviously some clearance body care. I'll probably pick up a couple things. So that's it. So yeah, thanks so much for watching, you guys. I appreciate you sticking around, even if you're not like a huge fan of my other videos. If you're still subscribed to me for these videos, the Bath and Body Works ones, thank you. <clears throat> you know, you don't have to watch all my videos in order to stay subscribed, and so I appreciate you. I will be doing a giveaway. I hit 3,000 subscribers like a week or two ago. I can't remember. Um, and I will be doing a giveaway. I'm trying to plan it. I'm probably going to be doing a Bath and Body Works product giveaway and then a, like a vendor wax giveaway and so then when you enter you'll enter which one you would prefer to enter into the contest for you know like Bath and Body Works versus Vendor Wax and so you can only compete in the contest for one one prize if that makes sense so yeah anyway <laughs> thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video bye